Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to add one additional SSD in the Alienware Aurora 6 and for that we're gonna be needing SATA cable there are two plugs for it, for two SSDs unfortunately Aurora 6 didn't come with SSD so I just bought it from Amazon, it was about five dollars for two I got 24 inch one so I'm gonna show you how to do it to start you might want to need to power off your computer I already did I'm going to unplug power cable and at the back as you can see there's one screw holding all of this side together so we will unscrew it pull this back and the side just comes out then you can see that right here there's one and there's a second tray for the SSD on the motherboard let's remove these cables right next to M.2 there are two SATA plugs two SATA sockets so as you can see the computer came without the cables I don't know if they all Coming without the cables or it's just mine you can just leave your thoughts in the comments but I was as I said I needed to buy mine so I got two of them this is from Amazon I'll leave, leave the link below for these cables and I have here crucial 2.0 inch solid state so we will add it and we will see how it works so you might want to move power aside so you'll have more access to get in so you can see them it's at this and this these are sockets right under video card you know, we can remove this too probably have even better access so my cable looks like that Some dust on it. and the other side looks like that this goes in the SSD this will go on the motherboard let's plug it in ok one in plug second one pretty simple it's not, just goes in until we hear the click now SSD aside for SATA we need these two sockets we're gonna use one which is the closer to this tray just plug it right in and I'm gonna use I don't know top one this doesn't really matter which cable goes in and just slide in there it is cables in we'll put a video card support back Easy. as it came out there it is perfect so as I said I got 24 inch cable see this is all extra can get less um, can get half of that I guess I'll get, I'll get 12 inch to be sure so we'll put all the cables inside Drive power back. Lock the locks. There's one and two here. Place back a panel. We 
can see the main drive, the M.2, 2 terabyte that was in the computer originally, and the one that we just added. So this would be the SSD. The G drive is just another external drive that I have for data and whatnot, but this one is SSD that we just added. Um, for this video, I just added this, I don't remember which, 223 gigabyte it says. Uh, in future, I will be adding, I'm thinking about 2 terabyte SSD for first tray and 2 terabyte for the second tray. Uh, one for video rendering and the other one for games. And as for this data, this current one, this has 2 terabyte and 533 gigabyte left and I've been having this computer for like three weeks people who is using a lot of video making lots of videos and downloading lots of games will understand why that happened how I went through the almost all space on my data D um, so this would be replaced with either 8 terabyte or 10 at the same, this one has 7200 RPM and the one that I'm gonna get 8 or 10 terabyte will have also 7 because I don't want to lose in speed so that would be it about the adding the SSD and slow upgrade of this Alienware Aurora 6 thank you everyone for watching please like this video and subscribe to my channel thank you guys